How long have you been single, Shannon? About two and a half, three months. What did you want that he didn't want, or what did he want that you didn't? I wanted intelligent conversation, and we had a lot of fun together. And he just wanted sex, no, basically. No, well, he, he tried <laughs> yeah. to participate in our conversations, and I, I just it didn't compute. What to were me the topics? What were the topics? <laughs> well... I I really like talking about conspiracy theories, actually. Oh, I'm, Dieter, I'm really, that's right up your uh, alley yeah. right yes. there. Yes. I can talk need, about that for days. And you need a brain to talk about that kind of stuff, yeah. Robert. Yeah. Mm-hmm. There are elite groups above government that control what's going there on. There are. Yeah, government's not the highest form of power in the so world. So the, the Illuminati are above, like, Obama, for instance. Mm-hmm. Like, I believe that the Illuminati is uh, an organization, secret organization, quote-unquote secret, that does control the people in the government, like as if they're puppets. Why Obama would Obama more? listen to him? Listen to who? The Illuminati. He doesn't even know. I don't. I don't know. Does why. he even know he's that the not, Illuminati exists, or are they so secret that he doesn't even know that they're the ones that are in control? He just I, thinks I'm he's in control. I'm pretty sure he knows what's going on. No. I think. So he knows. No. <laughs> so, Dean, are you? What was that? Is he in the Illuminati? <laughs> Wait. Yeah, I don't know. So you don't. He could okay. be. So he, he knows the Illuminati are there. Like we think that there's somebody in control, and then they are in a different world where he knows he's not really the one in control, but he has he has to appear as if he is the one in control. So you don't understand what I'm saying? That the look. Oh no, face no, is, I I understand. I just I I don't see how people believe this kind of hogwash. It's it's striking actually that people believe this kind of stuff. <laughs> It really is. Research it, man. There's it's some, all over, there's some, Rover. Yeah, it's all yeah. over the internet. You know, you you need to we, we know how factual the internet is. You should watch this movie called Thrive, and it's all fact. It's I swear to God, it's fact-checked. It's fact-checked. It's checked. fact-checked. You told me Loose Change, the 9-11 movie, not, was fact-checked as well. I did. We know that that's I did. not no, true. No, but this is, this is for real. Like, this Thrive is, is what this Thrive. This is what, like a documentary or yes. something? Thrive. I'll you can watch, watch it. it online. And this is the about the Illuminati? No, it's not about the Illuminati. It's about... Um, it talks about energy patterns in the world and how we all have the same energy patterns. And in order to, I, you're discouraging me right now. No, no, that. no. I, I'm <laughs> curious. I want to know what my energy level is or whatever. It starts off about energy patterns. It goes into like aliens and crop circles and how the government um, does know about all this kind of stuff. And then it continues into why our world the way is, why our world is the way it is because of those who are in power. I've always been into aliens, and that's kind of where I jumped off into my conspiracy theory love. So you you believe now? Do you believe that aliens visit the Earth? I do. You do. Mm-hmm. Are there any aliens on Earth right now, like among us, or are? I don't know. I would definitely say it's possible. It's possible. And why don't they just uh, say hello to us? Why are you so secretive about everything? Uh, I don't know. I don't think it's time for them to reveal themselves yet. Or Actually, I'm going to make a prediction right is now. Is the Illuminati controlling them and telling them not to come out? Maybe. I Who don't controls? Know. I feel like the extraterrestrials are more powerful. Than oh, so the e- so the ETs are above. So, all right, so we have Obama, and then the Illuminati above that, and then the aliens above the Illuminati. Sure. What's your prediction now? This is going to be good. I have a prediction. All okay, right, let's I, hear it. I predict that President Obama is going to win the election, and shortly after he wins, he's going to make an announcement revealing the presence of extraterrestrial life. Why do you make this prediction? Like, what evidence do you have that points to that? I read an article about it, and uh, <laughs> this is going to make me sound so much more legit, right? It was about this time traveler, and it was written. <laughs> Stop it! It was written in the year 2000, and this guy said, "I, I come from the year 2012, and this is what's going to happen." So he laid out a bunch of uh, things that happened in the year 2012, and so far, every single one is lined up to what he said. And then he also made the prediction that I just said. And he, obviously, time travel exists. Who's going to win the World Series? So does he put that in there? Because I'm going to play some bets then. I have no idea. It's not in the article. When did you read this time travel article? Probably in In 2012. Or in the year 2000. (laughs) I read it not too long ago. Oh, so So it could have just been, you know, like said that they wrote it in the year 2000 it but could be maybe i'm just saying well, i'm just, I'm I'm just, just saying, wondering december, i mean like when december comes along and this this may or may not happen but when it does i hope all of you think of me